This is part four in Measure and Mark Your World, and we're going to look at marking in the Using Interactive Maps in the Classroom to Promote Student Inquiry series. And we left off with doing our coordinates. And so now what we're going to do is we're going to go back up to the search bar, and we are going to search for the White House, and we would like the one in Washington, D.C., and notice here it brings me to the White House and what I am going to do is it pulled up the White House here there is a little link here it says add to map notes and now when I click on this notice on the left it is going to change something it now changed to the contents and it added a little marker right here so what you're going to do is navigate to the upper right and go to modify map and we're going to select the White House symbol so I'm going to go down here click on this and I now have something new on here where it allows me to edit and I now can change the symbol there's some other things I can do on the left but for right now I just want to teach you like the basic of how to change the symbol and let's say because it is the White House, I am going to go ahead and make it a blue star. I can even change the size of it a little bit if I want it a little bit larger. And just click OK. And then I can close it from here. But basically, this tool will allow you to create your own maps if you want to share with students. Uh, what would be required is that you do have a login, like a sign-in. Uh, you need an account in order to be able to save those maps like I can go ahead and save because I have a sign in um, and you could start to create maps that your students could specifically see things marked on um, you can even add bookmarks there's a lot of stuff you can do when you can start to mark up your own maps